My name is Samuel Mueller. I'm the CEO of Scandid. Scandid is a mobile computer vision platform that helps retailers blend the physical and the digital world by providing applications that allow a shopper, for example, to connect with products on the shelf in a very natural and seamless manner, look up relevant product information, check out very seamlessly, and complete the purchase very easily. On the associate side, our technology is being used to basically provide superpowers to associates, look up relevant product information just as well, but also really provide deep insights into the products that stand, stand on the shelf by identifying products in real time and serve up relevant information from store-based point of sale systems, ERP systems, or other sources to really give sales associates an advantage. Traditionally, brick and mortar retail would leave customers in store isolated and customers would not have access to relevant information before making a purchase decision. In the age of e-commerce that has naturally changed and as consumers were used to accessing relevant information before a transaction and guiding that decision-making process in very natural and easy ways. As a result, in order to stay competitive for brick and mortar retailers, it is critical to follow suit and provide similar benefits to our shoppers and customers. This technology is needed to bridge the gap between the product on the one hand and the user on the other. There are different technologies that can do this. First and foremost, we're looking at the cameras, probably the most universal sensor that allows to identify products without any further technological um, needs or, or helpers. Uh, Camera-based identification, as an example, uh, can support as facilitating a connection with a physical item, uh, represent the item in digital space, and then look up relevant information about that item to make a better product or purchasing decision. Uh, as a starting point, as a retailer, I need to bring my databases together and create a universal view of my assortment in digital space. Second, I need to be able to match this information to the physical products that I keep in my stores and uh, create ways for associates and shoppers to look up this relevant information. Third, I want to connect this capability to various forms of facilitating and enabling a transaction. And then third, on the fulfillment and delivery side, um, I want to offer distinct ways for consumers to be able to get access to the products that they purchased. It's no longer the case that once I've uh, purchased a product uh, uh, through one channel, for example, through the digital store, that I'm also basically getting that product delivered through that same channel. I may go and pay for a product in store, but have it delivered um, uh, um, uh, to my home, or I may buy online and then go and pick up the product in store through uh, Bopis. That they are able to drive more relevance to me as a customer, as a shopper, and support me in making the right decision at the right time and at the right pace. This means I can shop whenever I want, I can shop how I want, and at, uh, in the place I want. And ultimately, I think that matches up with my needs as a modern citizen and as a modern consumer. One particular example that I would like to mention is uh, Coop Denmark that has not only rethought how to engage and support sales associates in physical store locations and empower them through mobile apps running on smart devices um, that put them in a position to more effectively go about um, uh, typical retail tasks such as shelf management, reordering, restocking through a convenient and easy to use application. But more importantly, uh, Coop Denmark in this case has been a great example on how to bring self-scanning or scan and go to life across a very um, large store estate with more than 1,000 stores. Um, in this example, shoppers are able to download an app very conveniently and easily engage with products in the physical retail location, add products 
to a virtual basket and while doing so learn about product characteristics and properties, look up product information, add coupons and rewards uh, to their purchase um, or um, uh, take advantage of their loyalty profiles in doing so. The end of that shopping journey is then the transaction that can be facilitated very easily and seamlessly um, uh, through a simple checkout process and off you go as a user of the app and as a shopper uh, of Coop Denmark. So in sum, uh, Coop uh, Denmark has done a great job bringing these different technologies together, uh, um, really aggregating relevant information from their difficult store based and e-commerce systems to create a very compelling um, and comprehensive shopping experience through the app and with the help of modern technology, including a seamless way of interacting with products on the shelf uh, through barcode scanning and other means. There is a particular trend to watch, which is the convergence of different technologies that come together to provide particular business benefits to the user. While the past few years were marked by uh, individual technologies that created a hype or a lot of interest in the space, such as Amazon Go that hit the scenes about two years ago, what we've been observing over this past year and uh, will expect to continue over this coming year is really this convergence where technologies are being brought together, uh, mobile apps, uh, self-scanning, digital loyalty, uh, coupons, the ability to check out seamlessly and augmented reality as part of that to better guide customers to the right product and make the right decisions. These things are all coming together at this point, especially in uh, the context of retailers that have now spent some time rolling out such scan and go solutions to a larger scale and are now integrating a variety of technologies to create more compelling, more engaging experiences for their shoppers and create immediate value um, to them as well. In summary, the intersection of physical and digital retail is where a lot of activity is happening these days, where we're seeing convergence of different types of technology that, that are coming together to serve consumers into day-to-day -day and more specific shopping scenarios that are designed to uh, allow shoppers and retailers access relevant information before, at and after the point of purchase that are designed to make transactions more seamless and create a more compelling and more integrated shopping experience overall.